Hi, first grade class. So today I am going to read Pig the Pug, but then it's crossed off and it's Pig the Fibber. Fibber is another word for telling a lie. So as I read, remember to be thinking about the characters, the setting, the problem, and the solution. Here we go. Pig the Fibber. All right. Pig was a pug, and I'm sorry to say, he would often tell lies just to get his own way. And when he would fib, he was awfully clever. When Pig got in trouble, he would often blame Trevor. Yes, or excuse me, you see, he would mess up the living room mat, and then he'd just point and say, Trevor did that. Or he'd shatter a beautiful vase full of flowers, and then he'd say, Trevor's been crazy for hours. He, he once even ripped up a lovely old dress, and then he hid behind Trevor and made him confess. Why do you do this? asked poor little Trevor. I thought we were friends. But Pig said, whatever. Then came the day of Pig's sneakiest plan. He said, I will steal all the treats that I can. He, he keep, they keep them up there in the closet up high. But before I can get them, I need a good lie. And with that, he let rip. It was stinky and grim. Then he pointed at Trevor and said, it was him. How silly. So Trevor was taken outside for some air. This was Pig's chance as he climbed on a chair. Those treats will be mine and I'll gobble them all. But behind all those treats, what do you think's gonna happen? It was an old bowling ball. These days it's different, I'm happy to say. Pig has stopped lying, hip hip hooray. He may have some bruises and one less front tooth, but he sure learned his lesson. And that is the truth. The end. All right, friends. So our characters are Pig the Pug and Trevor. And then the setting was in the house. The problem, Pig often told lies to get his own way. We know that's not good. We should always tell the truth. And so the solution is Pig learned his lesson and he learned to tell the truth. He kind of did it by getting bonked in the head with a bowling ball, right? All right. Thank you, friends. That was a fun book today. Bye.